Well, some 70 plus companies are creating antibody tests for the coronavirus. And the FDA is keeping an eye on what's being developed. CBS 2's Leslie Marin has more. It's a question many people want to know. When will things return to normal? Today, in an interview, FDA Commissioner Stephen Hahn says the answer could lie in new antibody blood tests that can tell if a person has had the virus and is now immune. It's one of the factors that will go into this, including the underlying characteristics of the person. But with more antibody test sites now popping up, Hahn cautioned Americans about just how accurate some of these tests may be. I think it's really important for the American people to know that we need tests that are accurate, reliable, and reproducible. The FDA has already approved one antibody test and gave the green light to others to start testing as they wait for approval. The National Institute of Health started testing 10,000 volunteers. And locally, USC and LA County Department of Public Health have teamed up to test 1,000 people. So the goal here is to figure out who may have had this, and that's a critical number in figuring out how deadly this disease might be. The simple blood test starts with a prick of the finger. The results take just 10 minutes. If positive, the person may have antibodies that can be tested. Uh, antibodies definitely confer some immunity. We don't know the true extent of the uh, immunity. That's something they're hoping to find out. Most antibody tests are still in the beginning stages, but doctors are already seeing the impact it's having on people. They want that peace of mind. They want to know uh, whether uh, they are susceptible or whether they have uh, some immunity against uh, this disease. USC will be testing the same group of people every two weeks. There are also private labs that are charging people if they want the test done. Reporting in the newsroom, Leslie Marin.